Let's discuss submitting a video for legality review. This is done using the USASF Coach app, which is available for iOS and the App Store and for Android in the Google Play Store. To log in, you use the same credentials used to log in as a coach on USASFmembers.net. This is using the email address as the username and the password you selected. If you're not sure which email address, please ask your program administrator or email support at usasf.net. If you don't know the password, please go to usasfmembers.net, phone a browser, and click on the Let's Reset the Password link or the Forgot Your Password link above and below the login boxes. Once logged in, you'll be taken to the dashboard. To submit a video, you'll click on the hamburger icon, which are the three lines near the top left. This will make a sidebar appear on which you'll click Submit Video. This will take you to the Select Your Location screen, and once selected, you'll be taken to the Video Summary screen. From the Video Summary screen, click on the camera icon near the bottom right to submit a new video. This will take you to the Submission screen. From here, click on the triangle icon in the middle which will allow you to take a new video directly through the app or to choose an existing video from your photo library. Once you've taken or selected a video, you'll be taken back to the submission screen in which you'll name the video. You want to make sure you name it something that will be easy for you to identify later, such as the team nickname and the section of the routine. So your J3 Elite Sequence would be a good example because it lets you know which team and which part of the routine it is noting that you will not be able to change the name later. From there, you're going to click on the all-star type and select from among cheer, dance, exceptional athlete cheer, and exceptional athlete dance. Then you're going to select a tier from elite, fundamentals, novice, and prep. And then you'll select a level four cheer team or the category four dance team. These will be based on the tier chosen previously. Up next is selecting the division. The division shown will be based on the level or category previously chosen. Now for the other information and optional comment. The other information is the type of skill you want reviewed in the video. So it could be a building skill or a prop for a cheer team or the general rules and groups and pairs rules for a dance team. The comment is optional, but if there's something you want to make sure to review or see, feel free to add the comment there. But please note, anything they really need to see should be clear from the video itself. Now to upload the video. The upload button is on the top right of the submission screen. Once you click it, the video will transcode and upload, and then take you to the video summary screen again, where you'll see an additional video in your pending video count. From here, you can click on any of these numbers, the pending videos, legal videos, illegal videos, or resubmit videos to see what videos fall in that category. In our case, our video was ruled on as illegal, so we're looking at our illegal video tab, and we see the video from Amy's Happy Stars, Columbiana, the test video for the Senior 5 Level 5. We can use the tabs on the bottom of pending, legal, and resubmit to see videos from those other categories. Let's talk about app access and some other items. To have access to the app, you must be a USASF coach member. You must be eligible, which means you're paid or your membership was waived as an owner, and you must have a green light, and you must be attached to an active USASF member program. Some other things to know. The videos belong to the program, not the coach. Videos are location specific. Any coach from that same location can view all the videos from that location. And if a coach is dropped from a program, the coach will no longer have access to the videos, but the program will continue to have access to them. Some troubleshooting. If you're having trouble uploading a video, ask yourself and double check these things. Are you in the member database as a coach? Is your membership paid or waived if you're an owner? Do you have a current green light? Are you attached to a program? Is the program membership paid? If you answer yes to all these questions and the USASF Coach App functionality is still not available to you, 
please email support at usasf.net. Thank you and good luck this season.